Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, you beautiful souls. What is going on? What are you up to? What are you doing? And whatever you're doing, stop it and watch this video. Because that's marketing. Marketing! <laughs> As if I'm running a successful YouTube channel. Ha! <laughs> oh dear. But yes, you join me in a very blinding London. Just on the Chiswick flyover, so we're not really into London yet. Um, but we are heading right in, right into the city. And then we go going underground. But yes, once again, for the second time running, we're in my truck. How's that for fate? I've been in this truck all week, actually. It's been quite nice. Because um, the Moffat work's gone crazy. So putting the Moffat on the back of this was uh, definitely a sound idea. Um, yeah, I've had a bit of a weird week, actually. Today's Thursday, a day of recording. And on Monday, I had a load of turf to deliver. Okay, seven tons of dirt. Um, to a stately home around Stamford. Okay. And it was for a film set. And when I get there, it gets the security guard, you find all the little movie set signs and stuff like that. And, um, and yeah, mate, you get chatting to the bloke and he went, oh, what's this turf being used for? And he went, oh, it's for Batman's back garden. Huh? I thought he lived in a cave. And the bloke was like, yeah, I was, I was pretty much of the same opinion, actually. I was a bit weirded out by that one. Anyway, guess I'm that evening, I'm talking to Lily about it. So I haven't been out all week, I haven't even had a night out here this week. It's been a weird week. Um, talking to Lily about it, and I was like, yeah, but Batman lives in a cave, and she's up on all that Marvel DC stuff. Uh, apparently, no, he doesn't live in a cage, he lives in a, a cage, cave. He lives in a mansion. Uh, the more you know. I like the Avengers, but that's about as far as it goes <laughs> for me. Oh dear. Although Deadpool's is just the best. Oh dear. And so it begins. So it begins. The customer I'm doing the job for today, the, one of our lorries is literally to the left of me right now. <laughs> the driver keeps waving. But yeah, so 12 pallets go into the city. And down a tight little lane where I've got to go through a lorry van because the main access route is shut. Um, and yeah, that's that's pretty much that, unfortunately. I've been there three times this week. So I've told my boss about it, he was like, yeah, we'll wait for the fines to come through. <laughs> There's no other way around it, unfortunately. So, so yeah, you just gotta sort of live with it and appeal it when they come through. But yeah, so anyway, Normally in London, we, uh, we we discuss the route. I haven't decided yet. I think, head towards Harrods, turn right down Butan Place, round Belgrave Square, get yourself to Hyde Park Corner. People drive like idiots already. Um, down Piccadilly a bit, down Palm Mall, round Trafalgar Square, up the Strand, go up Fetter Lane, turn right, down past Old Bailey, get onto London Wall, turn right onto, uh, sorry, yeah, turn right onto Bishop's Gate, Go down past Leadenhall Street, Fenchurch Street, turn left onto East Cheap, and then we're down. But that's where we need to be. <laughs> oh god, it almost sounds like I know what I'm doing, which I really don't. Anyway, I need to call one's Papa now, and um, then I need to listen to Chris Madison tear track around here, a new one on the podcast. So yes, it's been soon a bit, mate. You can go behind me. It's fine. <laughs> Fenchurch Street is shut, we have to go to the wrong end of this lane. So, I'll go to my white indicator. Why is that doing that now? Yeah, right. Lots of mirrors, lots of mirrors, lots of mirrors, lots of mirrors. What's coming ahead? Lots of mirrors, lots of mirrors, and SAS have beat me. Damn it. 
So now let one of my attentions, you Mercedes person, you're just gonna be an idiot. And you wanna go and get Come on, pick it in. There we go. Does that sometimes for no reason? A bit too quick for it. This thing's got the most awful turning circle you've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, I was here yesterday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love it.
soon as you get out of my way. Oh, 
it's here. And it's just come to my distinct attention that I've run out of water. Mm. That's so bloody annoying. Ah. Do a bit of sightseeing, shall we? <laughs> Because where we're heading right now is towards the Tower of London. Yeah, that was 12 pallets. Whew. Feel like it's coming on the Moffat, so I hope my next job's not a Moffat job. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll have to go find some diesel. I don't want to do that. Also, a bit of bad news. My laces have snapped. The lace, the lace on my left boot has gone ping. Ah. Anyway. I'm gonna call my boss now and find out what we're doing. Oh, London is that annoying kind of busy. It's not so busy that like it's absolute gridlock, but it's that it's busy enough that everyone's driving around like lunatics anyway. Why don't we just let him turn right? He obviously wanted to turn right. But yeah, so we're at the top of Shaftesbury Avenue at the moment, so we go and see the theatre. Theatre. I did think about taking you back round to Fowler Square and Parliament Square and stuff like that and I just realised I couldn't be bothered <laughs> I won't lie to you I won't lie to you but yeah so it's been um, yeah, it's been a bit of a journey thus far from the city to High Holborn distance of three miles and uh, my brain has melted what's going on here then yeah look at him I don't know if you see it on camera there's so many buses going up to our right there up Endall Street, and it's just ridiculous. I mean, like, buses are meant to, like, to help ease the congestion, but when you have that many of them down one street, it turns into an absolute quagmire. Oh my god. Oh. Pardon me. Yay, my turn. Near as near as cause we're in London to the point in looking forward cause you'll just get a headache. Nice. And boom, Shaftesbury Avenue. Into the glittering part of the glittering West End in London, Soho. And we're past Chinatown as well. It's a town full of China. Like plates and stuff. But yeah, that was a very, very elaborate light board you had there, my friend. But yeah. Oh dear. Yeah, it's been a bit of an odyssey thus far. I'm just realised I haven't set my sand up. Oh well, I know where I'm going. But yeah. Wow. There's me thinking, I'll show you Shaftesbury Avenue. I haven't shown you that yet. And it's still chaos. Have you noticed I'm sat in the middle of the road? Everyone else is trying to split into two lanes, but there is no two lanes yet. There's no filter lanes. So I'm going to sit in the middle of a road to stop people acting like idiots around me and putting me into a tight spot. Come on. Since when did Harry Potter have a show? Harry Potter and the Closed Child, let's say. And the Cursed Child. Who's cursed then? Ah. Oh. Come on. Just my luck. Sorry people who's crossing I'm currently blocking, but apparently there's roadworks on Shaftesbury Avenue now. That's a new thing. If we turn left here, you take you down to Covent Garden. Turn right up there, it takes you up to the Tottenham Court Road. And a pub called the Cambridge, which I have actually drank in. Not a bad little boozer. There's where everyone starts shouting at me. If I could find a bad word to give, I would give it, but I can't find it. We clear our transport network regularly with rental viral disinfectant. Chaos. See what I mean by it? Is that annoying? Is that annoying sort of busy? <laughs> oh well. Mm. 
There we go. <laughs> oh, kicking off. Oh my god. Yeah. In front of it. So to our left there, if the bus ever gets out of our way. To our left, that's Chinatown. Um, well, the big cute park sign tour tells you that. Uh, that's Chinatown. To our right is where the majority of theatres are. So right in front of us, got Les Miserables and stuff like that. But yeah. Anyway, so the original reason why I started the camera was to say that I'm cutting this video short. Unfortunately, um, I've got to go back to the yard now, and now I've got to go load out of that security place. Unfortunately, means no cameras. So, um, so yeah, you wouldn't see much. You see me drive there and then drive back. That is about it. Um, I think I've got to go to Peterborough after that, though. So if I come back, then the will continue. If I don't, then it's not. But anyway, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the Dazzers 5K Challenge and donate to a great cause. Link down below. And also, come and check us out in Convoy on um, the 21st and 22nd of August. Me and Dapper, myself and Dazza and a few special guests will be, um, will be um, having a bit of a laugh there. So anyway, discount code incoming. So anyway, I shall see you in the next one, people. Stay safe and stay well. Bye!